started. So we have a dungeon claw, and then we want to pick up items. So I gained shield and I did damage. Intends to block, okay. All swords. Feels like Slay the Spire. Yeah, he's gonna swing. Sometimes you get a good grab, sometimes you don't. Okay. I don't know what the confetti stuff is. Okay, so it is just Slate Spire. <laughs> Old Dagger attacks nearest enemy. 3 plus 1 for each 10 coins. Ooh, Plastic Knife. Turns water into poison water. So it's Gold Dagger. So we get two claw grabs. It's not bad. I block all damage. Oh, wow. And I take damage. This is... This is weird. Okay. Let's see what we got. Pick your reward. Go with strength. They're gonna hit three times. So it's either shield, grab the gold dagger. Oh, we got one kill. Nice. Let's grab the shields. This game drastically needs effect sounds. Drastically. Forces your pets to attack. I don't have pets. Paperclip. Multiply by strength, sure. It feels very much just like, uh, Slay the Spire. The RNG aspect though with the Dungeon Claw. And then it's a boss. It's interesting because like while this is RNG, there's no direct control. I'm not sure if this is good in a sense that, dude, you get the full deck every new round. 
Like, how do I save this? You're in control, but you're not in control. Okay, increase health, two coins, all right. Heal after five, okay, sure. Okay. Oh, it's a trap door. That sucks. So you don't choose to, to attack, you attack front to back, and then everything is based off of your weapon sets. Now, because of some of the placement, I feel like... Dude, this is tough. Oh, and then they add poison in. Okay. Yeah, I feel like this might have been better if there was like more interactability with the inside. Because it's like you're kind of just yeah. some things are just poorly positioned. You can't do anything about it. And then I think this is a Jabait right here. Yeah, the claw hits the side. I could see where they were trying to go with this, but... I don't really think I like this. I get the game, I could see what to do. But this is like... When I played Slay the Spire, the fun of it that I had was making the deck. This doesn't feel like a card game. Because he took the deck making aspect out of it, so I'm kind of confused. Fills the machine with water. Okay. Let's see what that does. Oh, items start floating. Oh, that's horrible, dude. That means I can't grab items below. Ah, uh, drop. You get two shields. And then you get a bunch of confetti fluff. Oh, man. Water sucks. And then you can't grab anything because the shields. Oh, no. We debated ourselves, boys. The water goes down, though, at least. I guess it's good for when you need defense. Real man, I feel like this would have been better if it was like a pachinko or a ping pong, uh, ping pong machine, ping pong, uh, pinball, pinball machine. I felt like the claw design, I guess, while it works, I feel like it's, it's hard to really like build around this. Like, I wish I could shake the inside because the freaking items are not set up that well at all. I guess that's kind of like how you have a deck of cards and the order is preset and you can't really do anything about it. The worst thing about this is that all the items you use flop back down on the new rounds. 
So if there's an item you want, you have to dig it out. Ah. Yep, I got nothing. Shields are too big. Small shield is huge. Daggers are huge. There are times where I just pull nothing. Fluff ends up getting nothing for us. Oh, the shields. I just want the swords, man. Alright, there we go. Turns water into lava. The Pachinko Machine. Okay, let's play. Oh. Oh, I see. Ah, I gotta be a little slick. No! Yes! Dark Sword. Oh, wow. Okay. Where is my Dark Sword? Oh! Oh! Of course, I hold on to everything when I get the Dark Sword, because I take damage from that. Classic. And then when I do want everything, I get nothing. Drop three swords. Alright, now the items are getting moved. Okay, seem legit. Another Dark Sword. Uh... Okay. Oh, is the Dark Sword gone? I don't see it. Yeah, it does. I'm probably gonna wrap up after this run. Maybe head up to a new demo. The lack of sound effects makes this really unplayable, to be honest. The music's already repetitive enough. It really, really hurts it. This is the boss man. I'm not gonna lie man, a lot of these characters kind of remind me of Slay the Spire. This guy looks like the Act 2 boss. Or one of them.
two items. Classic. No, I got the water. I guess we could grab the, the wands. about this that I really liked about Slate Aspire was the potential of making combos. I don't see how that's possible in this game. Because you pick up a set amount of items with a claw. There's no way to get more claws, at least not yet. And then it feels like I'm just kind of at the mercy of like if I get a good pickup or not. The water sucks. I should never get the water. But I'm not gonna lie, this is tough. This is tough. The one shield. I will say that I don't think that I'm playing this perfectly, by no means. But it's like, man, dude, you can see the shortcomings. I actually think audio makes up for more than half the game. Like, you don't have to have a good game, but if the audio is like on point, everything is done well, it's gonna get good ratings. Realistically. So sound, quality, sound effects, music, variety, all that, very key to a game. You gotta be able to have fun doing whatever it is you're doing, but at the same time, man, the music's half of that. And the lack of special effects, man, it really is pretty bad. Oh, come on. So this is a cracked floor. Hard fight, interesting. Oh, I'm full health after the boss fight? Okay. I guess that's a thing. Spike balls inside. In most cases, I turn the music off just be and because I watch streams in parallel, and music for both games is too much. True. The music is already annoying for me at the point because of the repeating. It is. I feel you with that, man. I feel you with that. Since it's the only thing you hear, you recognize everything about it ASAP. Patterns, repetitiveness. Oh my god, oh it didn't roll in. Dagger. Drink from the pond, sure. Uh... Mm 
Yeah, it probably doesn't matter. Contagious Venom, skip the hard fight. We want the wand! Ah, oh, okay. I feel like that sometimes. And I don't get why there's fluff in here. Fadaika, thank you so much for the seven months. Appreciate it, man. Welcome back to the city. Hope you've enjoyed your stay. Thank you, thank you. All right. Okay. Reward. Oh, we got nothing. Alright, it's the Mothman. Oh, that claw got baited. Clip, never lucky. Interacting with some of the fluff, interesting. Hey, you've played this with Ica? Dude, this is new game, dude. You already uh, been on it? That's fast. Oh, I mean, at least it's only the, the Dark Sword, so I take no damage. Six damage. Oh, that was nine. Oh, that sucks. Thermostat. Did we get it? Yeah, we got it. Oh, they become poison things in gold coins. Oh, interesting. I've already seen YouTube playthroughs of this. That's impressive. Aww, didn't get the thermostat. Holy shit. Uh, we gotta go all in then. Okay, so if I don't kill him, we lose. Uh, gold dagger. Dark Sword is 35. Please don't fuck this up. Fight. 
extra hard fights. Pachinko reward. Wow, okay. Let's grab the Dark Sword. Take some damage. Do some good damage. Use the thermostat once we have damage on us. Pokemon. Oh, my Dark Sword got bopped, huh? Uh, let's grab this stuff. If I get it now, he's dead. And we got it. Okay. Hey, it's these guys again. My dark sword keeps getting taken away from me. feels bad. Alright. Uh, where is my thermostat? Oh, I see it. No. Alright. Dark Sword kills him. Did I hit myself? Dude, why did I hit myself? Double bladed sword, lose 5 health, 20 damage. Alright, we'll pass. Alright, where is my scepter? So we don't have one, that's unfortunate. Ooh, we have a thermometer though. Oh, that's not gonna help. Uh, I'll try this then. Ooh, no damage. I am looking for the thermo thermostat. Get it? Did we get it? Nice. And it did no damage. Feels bad. Hi, what's going on, DM Mina? How are you? Bomb hits really hard. Ooh, body armor sounds nice.
<laughs> I've got no perks. Uh, no items left in the stream. Dude, both of these are worthless. Alright, Cthulhu. I see you over there, buddy. Uh, let's try to get the body armor. Oh, come on, dude. Let me get the body armor. Alright, got the body armor upgrade. He got two upgrades. He's gonna hit me for 45. Oh, shit. Alright, man. We're just gonna tank his damage. Got another body armor. And then... I survive with 1 HP. Okay. We're gonna go all in. We're gonna try to grab a thermostat. Oh, there's poison damage on that? Aw, shit. Alright, he's doing another buff, and he has life leech, I think, every time he swings. Alright, I'm gonna stack the armor as much as I can. And I will try to grab a sweet grab right here. Oh, they didn't give me the freaking wands. Alright, another 45 plus poison. Okay. So, body armor. If we get the thermostat, that'd be really nice. Oh, and a gold dagger. Alright, so we are at 1426. Ah. Uh, that's not enough. I think we lose. We are at 12, 14, 26. He's going to do 45. These are five each. I would need four shields or a solo pickup here. Holy shit. Oh, man. I don't think I'll get it. That would have to be it though. And no solo pickup. That's tough. 24, 36. So we're dead. Oh, we're alive? Oh no, I'm dead. Oof. Alright. So that's Dungeon Crawler. 